today's video. Today I've got a real quick way through haul for you. Um, some meal prep ideas, some breakfast and lunch and some dinner ideas. Um, a lot of cleaning to be done because it is... A lot of cleaning to be done. All the kids are at school apart from this little one down here who's trying to say hello to you. Um, and then I want to rearrange some of the stuff up in the kids' bedrooms as well. I want to move a few bits of furniture around. Would you like to say hello? Sorry. Say hello. No, that's just being silly. Um, and we're going to make some cookies as well. Leave the camera stand alone. I'm going to have to go and cut this bit off short. But we're going to start before I don't have a camera and a camera stand left. <laughs> Yeah. What are these? Yeah. yeah. Chocolate. Do you like your chocolate? Yeah. It's a bit naughty. It's only 10 to 10 in the morning. Hello. But we'll do it anyway. Hello. You say hello. Family. Okay, don't tell daddy. What? Because daddy will tell me. Good. Yeah. But I think about you, about you all the time. Looks like you're changing and all. But well, why didn't you, why didn't you call? Something in the air, always something in the air. So not a massive growing through haul today, but we have got a few things. I've got some chicken to do our chicken kebabs, which all my kids absolutely love, which I do with some lemon and a few other ingredients. I've got some light brown sugar to do our um, Smarties cookies, which the kids absolutely love again. Some bananas to do banana and chocolate chip muffins. I'll put a few healthy things in there that the kids don't know about as well. Got some bacon and some eggs to do our omelettes for breakfast in the morning. Um, got Ethan some of these peach and strawberry jelly. He loves these. Got the peppers to do our omelettes with. Um, some blueberries to do our pancakes that I can put in the fridge and the kids can reheat for breakfast in the mornings. Some fruit for his lunchbox and some crisps. So not a massive, massive grocery haul. A few things to do a few meals. I'm really sorry about that noise. That is an airplane outside, or actually, I think it's a helicopter. Um, oh, and I also got some apple tango. I've been looking for this stuff for ages. I absolutely love this stuff. So I'm going to put this in the fridge and have a nice cold one while we are meal prepping our food today. Looks like you're changing and all. Well, why didn't you? Why didn't you call? This heart, yeah. Wanna feel your arms around me. I need you more, need you here more than I would like to admit. Let's forget about tomorrow, yeah. Should I hide away forever? Should I close my eyes and never again hold you tight, call you mine? Think about you every time I remember that it's over Yeah You never break, you never lie You never ever scared of the dark So why am I the one who cries? I'm so afraid to be left behind I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop Yeah, yeah You never lose 
argument So I've been trying hard to pretend That I'm okay It's just a phase And everything is going just great I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop Yeah, yeah I always knew that this would happen Yeah You would find a new distraction I need you more here more than I would like to admit can we let go of tomorrow yeah you never break you never lie you never ever scared of the dark so why am I the one who cries I'm so afraid to be left behind I think about you a lot it's almost like I can't stop can't stop yeah yeah never lose an argument so i've been trying hard to pretend that i'm okay it's just a phase and everything is going just great i think about you a lot it's almost like i can't stop can't stop yeah yeah your eye? Yeah, I did it in the ball. What happened? I did it in the ball so Daddy was holding one hand. Daddy was holding one hand and yeah. then what happened? Did you fall over? On my head. On your head. Oh dear. Does it hurt still? Yeah. Does it? Yeah. Oh, it's okay now isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to start making our marinade for our chicken. I am doubling this recipe so I'm going to put the recipe up here. So if you haven't got as many chicken breasts as I have, I think I've got about nine or ten chicken breasts. If you haven't got that many, just half the recipe what you see on here. Um, or you can do the whole, you can double it because the flavour is actually really, really strong. It's really nice. Um, but like I said, this is, this is doubled. So if you don't want it as strong, just half what you see on here. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is prep our chicken. We're going to take all the horrible bits off. With bits that look horrible, you know, those gooey bits. We're going to slice the tops so we can let the marinade get into them, and then we'll start making the marinade and I'll show you how to do that. Like so many times before, and I know that we're not perfect, but I'm gonna miss all that we had. Yeah, I know that we're not perfect, but I need this night for the last time. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need is some oil. I'm going to use this um, dessert spoon. It's not really as big as a dessert spoon, but I'm going to use 16 of these. It sounds a lot, but once you put all the other ingredients in, it's not actually that much. And it is only marinade, so I'm going to use 16 of these roughly. Okay, so we've got 16 of those. With those, we are going to put six of tomato puree. Again, it doesn't have to be exact. You can put a bit more in or a bit more less in, depending if you actually like it or not. So, I usually find six is actually a whole cheap, but we're gonna count it anyway. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so basically six of them is about a whole, a whole one of these. So that we're going to add some garlic. Now garlic is one of these things you love it or you hate it. Um, we like it but not too much so put this in. It's, usually, it's two, um, two of these but like I say put as much in or as less in as you want. You can leave this out. Okay now to that we're going to add some mixed spice. This one here. You can, oh, sorry, you can really see it, sorry. You can use all spice or mixed spice. It does taste the same. Like I said, I'm doubling this recipe, so if you don't want as much, you'll see half it. So I'm going to do one teaspoon of this. To that, I'm going to add, ooh, oh, it's a new one. I didn't realize, sorry. Four onion, four teaspoons of onion. One, two, three. Four. And I'm also going to add four of cumin. 
I've just been buying the cheap ones, you don't need the strong ones. Or oh, the branched ones, sorry. So one, two, three. Doesn't matter if it's um, done if you're going to mix it all in in a minute. You're going to need some pepper. Again, as much pepper and salt as you like. You can list this step out if you don't want it in there. And then the last thing we're going to use is three lemons. So we're just going to use the juice. You can use the zest as well, depending on if you like um, the zest in there as well. But I do find this recipe, the juice is actually enough to um, give it some flavour. Our ingredients in there, and then we're just going to mix this all together. Okay, so it's going to look quite a dark, ready colour once it's all mixed together. If you leave this too long, the oil and the um, tomato peel will separate. So, as soon as you've done this, you do need to get your chicken in here, to start and marinate it. Take Okay, then we're going to put this in the fridge, um, preferably overnight, but I'll probably do it for about four or five hours and then I'll cook it this evening and I'll show you what it looks like. We're now going to move on to our omelettes. I'm going to do bacon, mushroom. No, I'm not doing mushroom. So I'm moving on to the omelettes now. I'm going to do bacon, pepper, and spinach. And I'm not going to put any cheese on these. We'll put cheese on them when we go to heat them up. If you're wondering about my brews, I walked into a sign uh, when I went shopping. The sign was big enough, but I obviously didn't see it. And um, that's the microwave beeping. And I walked straight into it, and I bruised really easily. So that was really big. That looks really good now, actually. It's gone down quite a lot. Um, anyway, we're going to make our omelettes. 
bacon, spinach and peppers and then I will show you what it looked like when they had finished cooking. Right, going faster, getting wilder. Don't care if I get out of line. You feel that beat getting harder, floating on it. We're rebels, at least for tonight. I care that my mind's going insane and my heart will burst into flames. No, I don't care about the heart.
as you can see it's the next day i ran out of time yesterday um the time just ran away with me yesterday before i knew it i was on the school run and then there was the clubs and then there was dinner to be done and everything just ran away with me so we just i stopped yesterday and i'm back today also you can see i'm back today because different clothes so i have got an apology to make because i was going to make cookies and um then my daughter said that can i make can i make something else so i went into asda and i'm going to take credit i'm going to say i made them myself because they're not going to know the difference <laughs> Um, but I went into Asda and I got these. These are the Just Roll Cinnamon Swirls. My kids love these, so I'm gonna make these. I'm gonna pass them off as my own, because they're not gonna know. And yeah, I might have a cheeky one before I do the school this afternoon. you've enjoyed this video and if you have give it a like and a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you haven't done so already i'll be back on tuesday next week for a whole house clean with me so some real severe motivation for you all so be ready and i will see you then bye for now Enjoy.